So just having a look to see how deep the peat is here at Crumlin, just trying to work out where we can install some dip wells for hydrological monitoring. I'm here off the first boardwalk and I've already placed the, uh, the rods into the, the peat and we'll retrieve them out to see how deep it is. Each join is at one metre. So that's two metres. So here just off the boardwalk we have nearly 2.5 metres of peat. Okay, I've moved over slightly just to see if there's any difference. I'm guessing not, but just in case the platform has made any impact. I'm just placing the rods into the ground now. I'm going to break through that surface crust of vegetation. So that's one meter down. That's two meters in. That's three meters. We're still going at three meters, so I'm just going to go and get another rod. So that's four meters in. Just add number five. That's four meters gone, still going down nearly five meters. This isn't necessarily all peat, could be some silt there. Just to see how soft and deep it actually goes when we come to install dip wells we'll need to install earth anchors as well to stop them moving so that we get a true reading of depth okay seem to have reached the hard point there so i think that's six meters of rods i've used got approximately 50 centimeters sticking out of the ground so just pull them out That's one, two, three, four, five. Oh, it just keeps going. So you can see looking at this rod, how deep the peat actually is. So that's the first one, second, third, fourth, fifth and the sixth rod so approximately five and a half meters deep here that's an awful lot of stored carbon